So hi guys, today I thought I'd film for you the what's on my iPhone video just for you, just in case you're like me and you're a little nosy. Um, I have the iPhone 4S in white and I just have a clear case on it just to protect it because I prefer phones without my iPhone without a case on but I have to protect it. So my background is not coming up. My background is just a picture from when I left my last day at school and we all let off balloons and I thought it was a really nice picture so I've just got it as my background. So this is my iPhone. So at the top here we have messages, calendar, camera and photos. Then on the next line I have notes, videos, weather and contacts and then my clock. Here I have a lot of ones on my home screen are what already comes with the phone but yeah then I have newsstand and iTunes store app store mail and then my Instagram where I just scroll through pictures um, my Instagram is underscore Sophie Rose not just came back from holiday and look how nice the beach was and it was only in Cornwall then I have settings and along the bottom I have phones then I've got Twitter which I use a lot. I'm always scrolling down my Twitter feed. This is my Twitter. I've got my header from Tumblr. Which is where I tweet. I lost I've lost my sunglasses guys and it's really bugging me. And just do some pictures. There. Little me. But yeah. Um then I've got Safari and music where I have all my albums and on the next page I have my apps which I use a lot I recently downloaded 4D because when I then I have my countdown which is just things counting down so I've got my prom in five days my summer and I've got Depop which is a if you don't know it's a selling app where you can put things on and people can buy them. I've only got one thing on mine at the moment but I'm going to add some more. So yeah, if you want to follow me it's the same as my Instagram and Twitter, underscore Sophie Rose. Then I've got Facebook which I hardly use but it's just there for other stuff. Find friends. This might sound really weird but me and my family have this app where we can see where each of us are just in case you didn't know like you didn't know where they were and you just wanted to find them or if you're meeting them you can just click their where they are and go to their place like go don't google maps then i have a folder for games parking mania piano tiles with this game where you have to tap all the tiles stay in the line where a bit obvious and tippy tap it's the same as piano tiles then i've got my banking app then photography. These are the photography apps that I use. I have Afterlight, Insta Collage, Inst yeah, Insta Collage, Montage Light, Pic Collage, and Squarity. I don't really use these two, but I have them just. I don't really use. I don't really use these two, but I have them anyway. Afterlight is just. I love Afterlight. So I've just chosen this picture here. And basically, all you there's different. You can choose different filters and stuff like that, and you can change how much of the filters on it. Um, you can put light leaks on it. I sometimes I love to do this, and you can like swap them around, put them in different places, do the light intensity of the dust features on it. I don't know, and I think it just gives it a nice touch. You can also change all the regular things. Grain. Oh, that was good. Good remembering. And all stuff like that. You can then flip the picture upside down to the side. Um, you can put banners on it. And you can make them smaller, bigger, clear. Oh. oh no and I just and this is sometimes how I do my borders if I've edited it on here I just put one eyes on and then for Instagram and then I'm good to go and then I have these two this is another one that I use a lot 
basically you can just add a photo more than one obviously and then move it around change the side do a little collage put it on its side fade it put that one above it and yeah square ready which is just an app to get your borders on instagram if your pictures don't fit and then you are able to create borders and stuff so yeah and then coming out of that i then have my random folder it's called random because i don't use them that much they're my less regular things so i have another banking app i find my iphone for when i if i lose my iphone i can find it followers for instagram I'm, i don't hardly use that google maps when i need to go somewhere shazam which is just a music app to so you know what song you can find out what song is playing what the name is i have a link for our youtube channel which goes on to go straight to our channel it's a bookmark if you'd like and then here's our channel look guys 80 subscribers you can't see it's so annoying basically i'd love to thank you all each and every one of you who watch our videos and who have subscribed to us it does actually mean a lot to me and then i've got the three because that's what network i'm on a tube map when i go to london an app workout that i started using then stopped and uvu which is this kind of facetime kind of type of thing then i've got my snapchat <laughs> where i just send hello yeah, spotify i don't really use that much because i've got more music on my thing my tumblr i have two tumblers a one for just myself and another one um yeah then i have vine well if you don't have vine you should just get vine things always make me laugh and then i have whatsapp which is kind of a messaging app and then i have my youtube app which i use a lot probably my most used app oh go away where i just go and watch videos so yeah that was my iphone what's on my iphone thank you guys for watching um hope sorry guys we haven't filmed a video in a, so long it's just we have had exams it's been stressful but it's summer now for both me and ella so we'll love to carry on making videos for you to watch love you guys so much bye